Hello everyone, it's Kelsey here. Welcome and welcome back to my channel, Budget Better Life, where I budget, cash stuff, and save, oh, that's a new technique, for a less stressful, more enjoyable life. If that sounds great and you can relate, then keep watching. Okay guys, that was a really interesting intro. I was doing some weird things with my hands today. But anyways, what we're gonna do is count some change. These videos um, tend to be like longer and I would consider them boring, but also I would watch these videos. Like I really enjoy change. I like rolling change, I like counting change, but I always do it separate from my regular cash stuffing because I just don't think that everybody likes watching change um watching change you know what i mean um watching people play with change so i'm gonna try to make this one quicker than my last one because i'm gonna try to talk less and i think that's gonna help with cutting down the editing time and that's gonna help with cutting down the video time so this is all my change that i have been just collecting um i have also been collecting in this so this one stays downstairs right by um ew this is filthy um right by my door so when my wife gets in she empties her change usually just under the counter and then i end up putting it in here so this is the downstairs one and then this one was upstairs in my office when i would bring um, my wallet up and i would just like oh let's see if i have any change in my wallet actually i just toss the change in here and then i only deal with like the dollars as rollover so let me just dig through this and see if there's change to add to this before we get going yeah there is all right so that should oh whoa 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 all right, so that should be all the change that I have as of right now. And um, I got out my big piggy bank, but I don't need that actually because I don't, I'm not doing any dollars. Um, this is the savings challenge that we're working on. It's the 365 penny savings challenge. Um, and this is in the easy mini cash budget, thousand dollars or less savings planner. This is always linked in my description below. Um, I think I have it linked as um, savings challenge book. Um, but anyways, this comes from beautifully me and you. Uh, she is on YouTube and has an Etsy store. And then I got this off of Amazon from her. So um, that's what we'll be working on. So basically, I'm going to dump all this change out. I'm going to sort it all out. I'm going to organize it. And then um, I'm going to probably try not to talk. And <laughs> I'm going to just play some music while I do that just to try to keep this video short. We'll come back once I've got it all um, sorted out and we'll count it up. And then we will be putting it into this little guy, which is bubblegum. Because if you guys know my other piggy banks, marshmallow and cotton candy wait is this cotton candy or is this bubble gum no this is bubble gum so marshmallow and cotton candy are already full so we're working on filling up bubble gum and this one is a multi so we are putting the pennies and the silver into this one so that's what we're gonna do i'm gonna dump this out i'm gonna play a little bit of music and i'm gonna get to sorting Wow, okay, there it all is. All right, now I'm gonna get to sorting.
Okay, I've done it. I grabbed the marker that we need for the book and I grabbed my calculator. So now we can add up what I've got here. This one here is a Canadian penny and um, I have a spot where I saved all my Canadian pennies from last time. They no longer do pennies in Canada. They just round their change up. And so, I don't know, I'm just collecting them for now. So anyways, I'm gonna set this one aside for my little collection. Oh, by the way, this one's 1994 and it doesn't have any value or any meaning to me at all, except for the fact that I just don't know what to do with them, so I'm just leaving them. All right, so let's add up this. I've got everything in dollars and then these are in 25 cent stacks. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. This makes sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. Let's skip over that. 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. So I think that's 34 plus that's 50 cents. So 0.5 makes 50 plus 10, 20, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 0.35 equals. So I think we should have 34.85 here. I'm gonna quickly just count that one more time. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 50, 60, 70, 80, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yes, 34, 85 is correct, perfect. So then let's color in what we can here. So with this one, what I've been doing is the next highest one is 2478. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the 2478 and I'm going to minus it from the 3485 and let's see what that does. So minus 2478 equals 1007. Do I have a 1007? Oh my gosh, I have a 1008. Look at that. With this penny, it's 1008. I don't think I can put the Canadian penny in. I'm a penny shy. I'm going to do it anyways because I know I've stuck an extra penny in there. I've rounded um I've rounded up and stuff previously. So, I'm just che rechecking my wallet to make sure I didn't have a lingering penny anywhere. Yeah, I'm going to do that. So, I'm going to do the 2478 and I'm going to do the 1008 knowing that I have at least an extra penny that I've stuffed already. So let's color these in. And the 1008. Oh, now we got two more colored in, which is awesome. And I can clear this. And then the last thing to do is just stuff all these coins into this piggy bank. So I will get to stuffing. And also I will say this process was a whole lot easier now that I don't have fake nails on. I mean, I really, really struggled last time to pick up the coins. So also I have a lot less change this time, but yeah, this went a lot smoother. So I was super happy with that. All right, I'm gonna stop talking now so that I can stuff all of this change into little bubble gum. Uh-oh, uh-oh, this is not going well. 
It's getting so full. I think this is going to be it for, for bubble gum. I think we have filled all the piggies to the maximum amount that they can handle. And um, I'm going to have to roll all this change, which is kind of silly because I counted it all out and then stuffed it in here. And then I'm going to have to empty them all out and roll them all because I do like to roll my change because um, we used to have um, a machine at my bank where it was free for me to um, dump the change and uh, they would just give you the money for whatever you put in the machine, but they removed them. So they no longer um, offer that. And so the only place that we could go is like Coinstar and those places actually charge quite a bit. Um, and so I don't like to take the fee. I just roll it all myself, bring it to the bank and get the exact amount in cash. So that's probably what I'm going to do. I don't know if that's something that you guys actually want to see is me unstuff all these piggies, roll up all the change, bring it to the bank and then get all the cash for it. But um, once I do get that cash, it would go into this piggy bank um, where I have been putting all of the other um, dollars that I um, do in this book. So, I mean, maybe I'll do that for you guys. And um, yeah, grabbed cotton candy. Now, I should have washed my hands before I touched these because this change is really gross, but I grabbed cotton candy because I thought, well, maybe there's a little bit more space here. But yeah, I mean, we're like, we're at the max. So I'm just getting in anything I can here. Okay, only three more quarters. I think we can fit them. Come on, cotton candy. You can do it. You can do it. I don't know, I think that's it. Oh, okay, I made a little bit more space. Okay, that is it. These piggies are absolutely stuffed. All right, here's marshmallow. Marshmallow is stuffed, bubble gum is stuffed, cotton candy is stuffed. They are at their max capacity. So I probably will do another video where I unstuff them all, roll up all the money, bring it all back to the bank. Once I have the cash for that, I will put it into this piggy bank and then we will do it all over again and start to fill the piggies again. So that is going to be it for today's video. If you got this far, that is amazing and thank you for sticking with me. Um, but that's going to be it for today and other than that, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!